What's going on guys, Rob from clicksgeek.com and today's video I want to go through a question that we keep getting over and over again and a lot of people just don't seem to understand. What is a Google Ads consultant? What is their job? What do they do? What's their core function? And this is going to be a quick video. This is more for beginners. So if you guys are advanced at Google Ads or AdWords users, this is not for you. Okay. So Google Ads consultant, all they really do is run Google Ads on Google's platform to generate leads and sales for their clients. Now their clients can be anything from somebody who's selling, who's in a Shopify store selling e-com products, or they could be a, a service-based company like a plumber or a HVAC guy, an electrician, a car dealership, uh, you know, lawyer, any kind of lawyer. They can, and really it can be, you can run Google ads for any type of business that you need to send, you need to send um, targeted traffic at. So the most common are service-based, type companies, all right? So that's who your clients are mostly gonna be if you're a consultant. So if someone has an issue, and let's say that they have a overflowing toilet or the clogged drain or a pipe burst on their house and their house is filling with water, they need a plumber, right? So your job as a consultant is to create a Google Ads campaign for plumbers. And whenever someone types in certain keywords that you decide, your clients ads will show solving that problem. The whole thing is all about Google ads is solving a problem. So let's just take that plumber scenario. <coughs> Excuse me. So someone, I got water leaking in my house. All right, plumber near me is the type of stuff people are gonna search or plumber city name, whatever. So it's just plumber near me. So plumber near is what I actually put, but you can see these are Google's home service ads. These are regular Google ads. So your only job is gonna be when someone searches high intent keywords like plumber near me, plumber Philadelphia, cause I'm outside of Philadelphia. Um, overflowing toilet, <coughs> call a plumber, need a plumber, plumber around me, stuff like that. Whenever someone searches Google for those high intent keywords, people have a problem they need solved, all you're doing as a consultant is having your client's company show to solve the problem of why they're searching. All right, so if I need a plumber near me, here's all I'm seeing here is ads of plumbers near me. So obviously the more specific the keyword you go after, the better the conversion rate's gonna be. And that conversion rate just basically is how many people click your ad versus um, and turn into a lead or a sale or something like that. So that's the conversion rate in the Rost form. So you wanna basically have your ads just right here for when someone searches Google. That's all you're doing as a consultant, it's your only job. Now there are two ways you can do this as a consultant. You can go through and learn how to do these campaigns yourself, which is a, an education to say the least, but you know, Clicks Geek, we, we we have courses on to teach you how to do this stuff, or you can learn it on your own, or for free, you can learn it on our YouTube channel. Just go to Clicks Geek, our YouTube channel. We literally have over 100 playlists of different ways of how Google Ads works. I even have playlists where we build campaigns from scratch all the way through to successful lead generation campaigns, and you get to watch over my shoulder the whole time as I do it. So there is definitely a lot of free ways you can do it. So that's the first option, all right? You can learn the stuff yourself, and take on the clients yourself, and do all the work. Or you can white label a solution. So you just bring your client to a white label provider like us, like ClickSkeek, and they do all the work under your brand, okay? So if in white label, all you're, all you're doing then is managing the client relationship. You're not doing any of the actual Google Ads work. And this, this works well for people for a few different reasons. So let's say you have um, fordonnellys.com as your client, and they want leads you know, using Google's platform, so we, you know, you run a Google ads campaign for them, whether that you do that yourself or you white label it. And then they might be like, hey, you know, I want Facebook ads too. Well, if you don't know how to do Facebook ads, you're not gonna go out and, you know, learn Facebook ads from scratch as soon as they tell you that. I mean, you can, but I wouldn't recommend that. You're gonna go through a white label provider, all right? So the, the good thing about using a white label provider or option two, as I call it, is you don't have to be the master of all trades. You can, you can have a client and you can provide them any service they want and, you look like the expert because it's all under your brand. Nobody knows the client, the end client for Donnelly's.com would never know that you are not doing the work. Okay. Cause all the white label provider is doing is building these campaigns, making sure they run smoothly and they're doing it all underneath your brand. All right. So that's the two options. You can learn all this stuff yourself, which Google ads a lot of people do because they don't want to pay a white label provider for anything. And I totally understand that. Or you white label it. And you have to just have to make sure it's super important, guys, and I can't stress this enough. If you do choose second route, which is white label, make sure you find out what the pricing is for the white label provider and you factor that into your fee for 
whatever you're charging the client, all right? Because if you're if you're charging, you know, four dollars dot com here, five hundred bucks a month, and you're a white label provider, and they say, oh, it's a uh, four fifty a month. I mean, you really want to manage this relationship with the client and do all this work for fifty bucks a month? No, it doesn't make sense. So you have to make sure that you're you have all your numbers straight and you're you know charging the right amount of money so you can make money. So now if you want to take the route of being a consultant and learning Google Ads, if you want to see what that looks like, I'll just jump into one of our accounts here. You can see here these are all different niche um, Google Ads campaigns. You set your daily budgets, all that stuff. But this is, uh, I just kind of want to show you what the back end looks like. This is not a tutorial on building a Google Ads campaign. Obviously, it's just a consultant stuff. So those are the two options, guys. You can either you can either learn all the stuff yourself, or you can white label. You can just all your your only mission is getting clients and white labeling the services, which is what a lot of consultants do actually. And um, there's a handful of different white label consultants. Obviously, we do white label consult. We do white label uh, fulfillment at Clicks Geek, but there's a couple other dozen. There's a dozen other ones that you can use as well. I'm not saying you guys have to use us, but those are your two options. Um, Consulting is great. I mean, a lot of our ClicksGeek white label stuff is mostly consultants and other smaller agencies who just don't want to learn it and don't want to hire in-house because it's expensive. So it's always definitely an option. Well, hopefully I've answered that question for you guys on what a Google Ads consultant actually does. It's it's very simple. They just connect clients with Google Ads campaign. <laughs> That's all you're doing. Your only job is to get clients and to provide them a steady flow of leads via Google Ads. So hopefully that answers your question. Again, if you guys have any more questions, about uh, Google Ads consulting or anything like that, drop them in the comment section below this video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and check out the links in the description. I put some uh, some cool stuff in there for you guys.